hi guys welcome to our Zenden. my name is valerie um so if you're seeing the title of this video i am currently on the icon of the seas the brand new ship from world caribbean i cannot believe how lucky i am to be here it is blowing my mind that i'm still here i'm just so excited to bring you guys on this trip with me right now i'm going to show you guys a quick room tour because it is absolutely beautiful so let's go and check it out okay so as soon as you enter the room the bathroom is right here to the right there is a little place to put clothes or towels up there and this bathroom is just absolutely amazing i love the shower the door is so so pretty because it opens in a very cool way that is so cool and the shower feels pretty spacious and this is the sink area there's a lot of shelving there's also an outlet right there beautiful sparkling clean a lot of shelves here as well and inside the shower there is a towel rack so you guys can leave your towels in there and just closing this up so cool there is a ton of space actually here for shelving so if there's any worry about that there is a lot of shelving space and i think I think down here is more more space oh this is kind of like slanted that's kind of cool so here is the temperature and here are the different light switches so this one is full lighting on the whole room this one is halfway and then this one obviously is no lighting i'm not sure what these mean i'm sure you can set up the lighting however you like but i'm not sure and then these switches are for if you want to manually turn on and off the lights so to the left there is a coat rack right here and a very very large mirror with a beautiful lighting that goes all up the door the doorway and this is the desk area. I absolutely love the shape of that mirror, so beautiful. And they were nice enough to give me a Icon of the Seas cap, which I will definitely wear. And this is so spacious and there is a lot of storage space. You got your dryer and some tissues. And the rest, I believe, is just empty. Oh, and then you're a breakfast menu if you want uh, room service. And maybe here, oh, there it is. It's the mini fridge and it's right there. Oh, it's nice and cool. Right behind the bathroom is actually the closet space, which I love these little baskets here. It is so cute so you can see some of your things. I have yet to open these, so I don't know how they look like. Ooh, so it's a very skinny tall closet here. I'm not sure what this little box is. Maybe it's the safe. Hmm, maybe this is just to put stuff on top because I don't know if it's anything specific. Oh, and there's two little coat racks here. And this is the big closet area. There is a lot of hangers, so there's no worries there. Very spacious and very deep also. And obviously you guys can get laundry service if you desire. There's even like a little hole space in here. So in front of the closet is this beautiful sofa. I'm not sure if it converts into a sofa bed. I'm guessing it does, but I won't be needing it. So I unfortunately won't see it open, but it is absolutely beautiful. And I love the artwork on the wall. And then is the beautiful bed. I don't know what size this is. I believe it's a queen, I'm not sure. And then on the side, it's a nightstand with a really pretty lamp and the phone, of course. And very important, there is a USB outlet right here. So that is very, very helpful. And below the phone, there is additional storage, which is awesome. So this is in front of the bed, the TV, and a lot more storage on this side. And it also has more USB outlets, so that is amazing. And the other nightstand has a beautiful lamp with more outlets and also like a regular plug outlet there. And fortunately, this room has a balcony, so let's go outside. Hopefully you guys can hear me because there is a lot of noise since we're still in the port of Miami. I will say that this is very, very tall. I'm 5'4 and it is very tall, which I appreciate. And I just turned all the lights in the room and there's a bunch on the walls, which is so beautiful and above the bed as well. And this is what the room looks like with the curtains closed. Obviously there's light outside, but I can totally see this just pitch black dark at night. And this is what the rest of the room looks like with all the lights on. I absolutely love the doorway, how it's all across. It's so 
beautiful. I am so excited. I still can't believe I'm here. I will show you guys as much as I possibly can. I know that this ship is very, very large, so I will try to record as much as I possibly can. Don't forget to subscribe. I have another pair of Royal Caribbean videos on my channel, and I do have a Silver Sea one. So if you want to go check that out after watching this video, go ahead. And yeah, I just I can't wait to start this journey. We have arrived at perfect day at Coco K. I am so sorry if I didn't record as much as I did yesterday night. I just feel like I was taking it all in without having the camera there and it still feels very surreal that I'm here. It's actually a little cloudy here at Coco K so I'm not exactly sure if we're gonna get down or not but if I'm not I am gonna take advantage and record the ship for you guys and see what we do. I will show you guys what I see in a moment. So now I'm just gonna get ready and go have some breakfast and see if it's still available and open so let's go Thank you. 
all right so i just came back from breakfast it was so good i honestly grabbed way more than i actually ate it was so busy so i really tried to film as much food as i could for you guys but hopefully you guys enjoyed those little clips of the food so now i honestly i still don't know if we're gonna get off but there is like a airplane show or something happening in a couple of minutes so hopefully i can see it from my balcony and obviously i will show you guys so let's go see
good morning guys it is day three this is our last day here i'm so sad i don't know if you guys can hear that but i woke up to a band playing outside so we are officially in the bahamas and again i don't think we're gonna get down because i want to continue exploring the ship but i do want to show you guys the marching band <laughs>
I'm pretty sure when I woke up this shit tomorrow morning at 10 o'clock, it's fucking 10 o'clock in Miami. <laughs> I don't know what world you're living in exactly, but that would be weird. Hey, what time's the movie start? 10. I'm going into 10.45. Fuck it. Miami time. You know how this works. <laughs> Don't hold it for me. I'm from Miami, of course, and uh, I've got some restless legs. I'm going to get there. Anyway, welcome. Hang on. Let me move this so y'all can see. So welcome to our... <laughs> That's real rude. I go to guest services often and I go, what's the stupidest thing we've heard this week? <laughs> and you want to believe, like the dumbest one for the month of December on Wonder, and I've said, a woman went to guest services and asked if the water was what was causing the ship to rock. <laughs> How do you answer that? It's like, oh no, actually, all of our fat guests are ice skating. <laughs> These are my top like 10 favorite questions and complaints that guests have ever asked. And some of this shit is so, you're not even gonna believe this. It was our honeymoon on board Wonder of the Seas and the captain completely ruined it. At the beginning of our cruise, we had a nightly view of the sunset from our stateroom. On the way back, the captain changed directions and we lost our sunset view. <laughs> You know what, we'll just back the fuck up all the way to Miami so you can have your sunset. How about that? This will be my family's last cruise with Royal Caribbean because we experienced much nicer weather on Princess. Okay, that makes sense. That makes sense. We've got paninis, you know, Princess has gone. Our, our children are terror. Oh, this is so fun. Our, our children are terrified of fish. No one informed us fish would be on the snorkel excursion. The three of us are going to be on here for the next year. You're going to see us. We're going to be entertaining the guests for the next year.